We're going to multiply a two-digit number by another two-digit number. When sharing this strategy with students, you want them to practice decomposing those larger numbers or multi-digit numbers based on the place value so that they can multiply numbers that they're comfortable with. So we decompose 35 into 30 and 5, and then 47 into 40 and 7, similar to using the expanded form. Then we want students to draw their rectangle, or more like a square, and make connections knowing that, okay, I have four digits here and four digits here. There are going to be two parts going horizontal and two parts going vertical. So I'm going to write 30 here and then 5 here, 40 at the top, and 7 here. It's okay if students draw their parts equally. However, when showing them the strategy, you want them to make the connection that tens are larger than the one. So I'm going to have more space for those tens than I will for the ones, just so that they can connect it to actual area, finding the actual area. So next I would have them write a symbol, the multiplication symbol here, just to remember that they're multiplying and to write the expressions in each space that they're finding the part, the products for. So we have 30 times 40 here, 30 times seven here, 5 times 40 here, and then 5 times 7 in this smaller piece at the bottom. As students get to the point where they're multiplying a two-digit by another two-digit number, a lot of them will be comfortable with just writing the products and not having to write the expression, but it's whatever students are comfortable with. So we know 3 times 4 is 12. 10 times greater than 12 would be 120, and then 10 times greater than 120 it's 1,200 or 1,200. 3 times 7 is 21. 10 times greater than 21 is 210. 5 times 4 is 20. 10 times greater than 20 is 200. 5 times 7 is 35. Again, we want to take the partial products because we don't have the total product yet. Rewrite them on the side so that we can join those partial products back together to find the total product. And then students will need to simply add them together. It's very important that they line up their numbers based on the place value so that they're not mixing ones and tens together. So we have five ones, we have four tens, we have six hundreds, and we have one thousand. So the total product of 35 and 47 is 1,645. We multiplied a two-digit number by another two-digit number using the area model.